Good morning, everyone. It's good to connect up with you again and continue my uh, rather self-indulgent uh, 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 reflections uh, on my uh, railway this summer holiday. And um, uh, we've thought about the charging the batteries, charging our batteries. Uh, last time I talked a bit about laying down the track and how our prayers uh, can help us to uh, to lay down the tracks on which uh, the power of God can can come to us. And so today I thought I'd connect up uh, the tracks and the uh, the loco, the little train here. So uh, I'm going to uh, uh, head on outside and uh, uh, share that with you uh, now. So here we go. Loco uh, down onto the tracks. And uh, I'll just bring you a bit closer so you can see uh, what I'm up to. So we've got it down on the tracks. At first, all seems well, ready to uh, to ride. But then you might notice, if you look a bit closer, that the uh, the wheels are not quite aligned with the track, and that is going to mean uh, well, it's not going to go anywhere. It's already derailed before it's even started. Uh, so uh, the first uh, thing, once I've got the once I've carried the weight of it uh, out here, uh, is to make sure that the wheels are aligned. Uh, and once they're aligned on one side, I know they'll be aligned on the other. And then a quick check that it can run uh, fairly smoothly backwards and forwards. Uh, and so all is well. Let me bring you a bit closer so you can see how that all aligns up. It perhaps seems a small, uh, small thing to, to to do, a small thing to to mention, but uh, it is always a key before uh, before any any movement begins between uh, the the train and the track is to make sure that the wheels are aligned. And uh, I share that as a as an offering and a, a connection with with the faith that we uh, pursue, the Christian faith. If that's uh, your uh, uh, your faith that uh, uh, I'm reminded of Jesus' story, one of the, one of the one of the favourites, uh, and it comes in a very very short sentence as ever. But uh, it's been been um, inspired songs and and more stories ever since. And that is when Jesus says, uh, "Those who listen to me uh, and trust in my words are like uh, those who build." their house on a on a rock on a firm foundation uh, not listening to Jesus as Jesus words uh, and learning from him is like building our house on the on the sand when the storm comes it washes away but the, the house built on the on the strong firm foundation of the rock when the storms come it stands firm that connection uh, with God's word that connection with Jesus and all that he means to us uh, is what I'm reminded of when I think about the connection of the uh, the, the train uh, with the tracks. Uh, that connection together is going to squat, is going to be what enables that journey to uh, our journey to progress, uh, as it will do at some point later on in the summer. Uh, and there will continue to be uh, derailments. Oh yes, as uh, as we go on round the track, but uh, that will just call for a. a, a short pause uh, and then a realignment a realignment of the wheels and the track a realignment of our lives when when those storms come to make sure we are fully connected in with the the firm foundation that is uh, that is Jesus and his uh, his words and his uh, and his focus on us so yeah I'll, I'll, I'll leave us there and uh, and pray into to this day this day that promises to be a uh, a warm one and we've got a got a heat wave going on in this part of the world so let's pray lord jesus we thank you for your words your uh, uh, your reminder at the end of your sermon on the mount uh, through all that you've said that, that the key is that we trust in your words that we put our faith in your words that we make them a firm foundation for our lives that the wheels of our lives fully connect with the rails that, that are your word uh, and then our journey can continue. Lord, we know there will be storms, there will be derailments, uh, but we know when we are fully connected, our journey can continue. We can continue our journey with you 
uh, and that is what we want as Christians, to follow you, Jesus, and be on the journey with you, for we know the journey with you is the, is the journey that, that's, uh, that we're called on. So lead us on, we pray. Help us to connect with your word uh, and with all your works that we can read in, your, in, in the Bible and, uh, uh, and show us the way ahead, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Good to connect up with you again. Oh, there'll be more coming. Don't you worry every Tuesday, hopefully, uh, through the summer. Uh, I look forward to connecting up with you soon. Uh, for now, take care in the sun and uh, bless you.